double team. Pino. Two left. He's going to have to put it up. One left. Mitch Creed put it up, Mitch. Wow! That is sensational. Talk about the incredible. How incredible was that? In the crisis, have a look at this. You were counting it down, Dwayne, and just gets it off. And Gibson pulls it down the floor quickly. Gets it into the hands of the hot man, Mitch Creek, who had three against him, and still good enough, Mitch Creek. A bit of Crockett in transition. He high-tailed it down, forces the defense to, to guard him because he's going so hard at the basket. Opens up that lane, and Creek takes advantage uh, of it. That wasn't, that wasn't an answer on the I know. That wasn't an option. I know. <laughs> John Robinson broke their ankles, gave it to Mitch Creek, and he jams off. Five seconds, four left. Mitch Creek, little up fake. Didn't get Tarangi in the air. He puts it in anyway as the clock expires to end an epic quarter. In the first half against the Breakers in Christchurch, Phoenix have the lead with three. Oh, oh what, Mitch what? Creek slaps it against the backboard. And Ashley again. What a recovery by Mitch Creek, who was well out of the play. Three Creek, Pino. Speaking of players against his old team, the ex-Sydney King. But Dane Pino could be a regular double-double guy as well. Yeah, I agree. That's where Dane's going to have his career. It'll, 10 and 10 is very easy. Oh, great block right. by Mitch Creek. Mitch Creek denies Ogilvy and it sparks Madgen for the and one finish. Credit to Mike Kelly and no the staff as well because they made adjustments after a slow start to the season. Out of the timeout, Creek comes up with an important two. Self in scoring positions to uh, provide a pressure outlet. Team Wesley gave himself a tough shot at the other end. There's a good take though from Mitch Creek. Let's see if they can make the most of it. Madgen oh, gets a bit of help to lay in the two. Here's Walker. Some nice moves for Oliver, who goes back to Wesley. He puts it on the floor, and just inside the shot clock, Mitch Creek gets it done. Difficult shot. He can't make it either. Gee. Uh, Creek makes absolute sure of it. Mitch Creek, seven points. That they've got a legitimate backup. A steal by Casper Ware. He was looking for the alley oop play with Cooks, and Ware yeah. stays at it but throws it towards Mitch Creek. So a little helter skelter to start this one. And the runner from Creek too heavy. Second time around, it's much better. Now you've got to sit for a period. Isaac Humphries was great on Sunday. 14 points, 12 boards. He comes in for his action. Side. Great little bounce pass to Mitch Creek. He throws down the hammer. That's such a quick turn of pace from Sykes there to hit Mitch Creek, but down the other end, the two possessions in a row. Mitch Creek doesn't want to waste it. Sykes, Creek, two left, had to pull it up. All right. They've arrived late to the party, but they're here now. A good deed from Wetzel. Held him at bay. Scoop pass from Adam to Mitch Creek. Alley who play for Glidden, who gets it done and draws a foul. In 10 games, when Zealand and Lott have been trailing at the end of the first quarter. They've only been able to win one of them. As Creek steps up. Nails one on the stroke of quarter time. Phoenix with the last possession. Creek with time elapsing scores right on the buzzer. I was from an offensive point of view. He was happy with their last two possessions, but he said prior to that they were stuck in mud. He'll be happy with that one as well. Get a reward, and Shyla Hill got a big one. So well done, Hammer. It's a creep. Hey, that the second half. That is how you come out and make a statement early. Hand off. Have a look at this. Fake the little handoff, and Brandon Paul chasing around the top. On camp. Just getting to the ring whenever he wants to kickstart this game. He's had a nice start. You spoke about it, Hooley. That's a steal by Mitch Creek. This has been a horror start for the Taipans. From Brisbane in this corner. Creek, what a pass to Moore. This thing's done. Talk us through it here, Liam. That beautiful ball movement from the Phoenix. Pick and roll with Ben Moore. And kind of get a one-on-one -on -one possession from Kyle Adam and, and chuck something up. And now they can run a good set, good clean set. Creek made it work. 
I'm certain that's not how it was drawn up. And Creek's on the move behind the back for Tarangi underneath. I told you he's a willing passer. Played through my man Wolf Creek and we good. Finalists probably right before they came out to warm up. What a pass from Mitch Creek. But it's all been Ben Moore. He's the one who's really changed this game since coming into it. Play eight and a half minutes, got eight rebounds and five of them offensive. Sykes works together with Creek, who's fouled, and those points will count. For the Phoenix, they've got a pretty quiet squad for the most part. They need more of those moments with the job of trying to quell Kiefer Sykes. Wetzel hands off to Creek. Another three. Big hit. Hopefully it's nothing too serious. With Creek from outside, drops the second. Give them up, son. It's but six field goal attempts for the game. Go. That is not enough. The Phoenix forced a turnover at halfway. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, Creek sir. took a yes, body. Oh, this from Mitch Creek. What? That is a spectacular flush. Welcome, Matthew Delavadova. That man has a family. Jeez. Six points, six assists for Mitch Norton. Four is the margin. Last play of the third quarter. Mitch Creek fills it up on the buzzer. Nice finish from Mitch Creek. All under control now. One on a shot clock, no possession. As we heard the referee say, Creek's going to let it go. Wow. Wow. Creek behind the back for Liafa. Got it. Creek showing us the full repertoire. And get to the paint as we see here. Good pass out. Up fake behind the back. Nice basket. Glidden. No. Creek. Yes. Because I'll go to the long break in front. There you go. Mitch Creek. No one near him. Last play of the opening quarter. Chance for Mitch Creek and the Phoenix to go coast to coast. He muscles his way in down low, makes it fit off the window. Nice finish to the opening quarter. Couldn't get him going. They want to push through Sam McDaniel. Great outlet, but even better defense. Leafa down low, Mitch Creek up high with the block. You can see they were falling into, we need that slow offense, but if the shot's there when you turn a corner, Great good pass. pass. Tough finish. Ball movement is good for the Phoenix as the half winds down. Mitch Creek puts a nail in the coffin of the first half. Harrison thought he was fouled, couldn't get a whistle. Brown feeds Creek and opens up for him in the lane. Athletically, Mitch Creek gets it done. He's got eight in the game. This guy can get going. And he's aggressive. He looks for the for the shot. The Creek in transition. Happy to take it at Brady Manick and off the window for two more. Lead by 16. Biggest lead in the game was 18. Early stages of quarter number three. And again, it. Another turnover. Here comes Creek. Yeah, it's a fun there. Mitch Creek, the milestone man. The turnover up in the lane, and he's ahead of the pack. Finishes with authority. There's a delay game warning following this gun, not sure. Last minute of overtime. Clock at 10, Creek pulls up. Bang! Oh, that's a massive shot. 44 for Mitch Creek! Walton Jr. with the response oh. at the other end! Oh. This is incredible! Wow! Points, Mitch Creek, 44, and both of them hitting some huge. Because obviously he's proving right now that he can beat you in that mid-range, uh, in that mid-range area. 12 points on four or five, shooting for Adnan. Now he distributes to Creek from downtown. We know what he can do above the rim, though, and of course for every dunk. Seven points up with just over a minute left. Creek drives and scores, and the extra. Travers, all the work he's done on developing his stroke comes up in a big moment.